There are many economic hardships in the COVID-19 era. But some of these businesses, like the Pack Nutrition, are attempting to test those odds. A lot of social media work, meaning getting to know people, building a strong relationship. And then um, we do all of our marketing and everything on our own. Uh, so just spreading the word that we are here, that we're providing healthy drinks, uh, great vibe, positivity. So uh, just a lot of one-on-one -on -one invitations to come in. While the pack has a location in Lakeview as well, they decided to open another in Rogers Park. I feel like Edgewater and Rogers Park are like underrated in the city. There's so many amazing people, so much culture, so much diversity up here. And there's so much opportunity to connect people together around something um, like like-minded, around something positive. So that's what we wanted to provide. While this is only a soft opening, people can come in and choose from a tea or shake with a focus on nutrition. For me, when I was in college, I did a lot of things to look a certain way that necessarily weren't always the healthiest. So we wanted to provide a non-judgment, very positive environment where people know they can get something healthy that can benefit their life, help them study harder, help them um, like really focus, and be really convenient just two blocks from campus. The PAC focuses on providing a social space for the community. Yeah, we don't use any outside apps or anything like that. Um, everyone has been coming in based on word of mouth and like person to person invitation. We've built a lot of relationships with like um, the on campus like rec center, all the like sports teams, people from different like sororities, things like that, that have been helping us spread the word too. But also prioritizes the pandemic safety at the same time. We want to make sure, you know, before we can open for like seating and things like that, things are better. But the pack still has plenty of customers, making it a nice break from the outside world. In Chicago, Illinois, Mary Kate Gallagher.